project is, has come out of, um, I would say it's come out of the last two pieces that I've done, really. And it's an exploration of how um, female identity is presented in performance. Um, I'm interested in looking at that from the point of view, from an expansive point of view, from the, from the point of view that uh, every person is capable of, of holding within them a whole host of experiences. And we don't know the complexity of somebody's identity when we first glance at them. I think that, that dance and movement can be an interesting way to remove certain filters and to give somebody an opportunity to be visible by giving them a task that requires their full attention, their full commitment. So I'm not trying to make female movement, but I am trying to make myself aware of how things are read as female and how other people code things as female. So, you know, I think that right now I'm thinking that means partly how you use your pelvis. People code that as female, you know, if you have like something Female and sensuous, that's the feedback I get. So if you have things that involve like undulation or spiraling or circling, how you use your pelvis, how you use your spine, how you let your head fall. And I think it, it's cultural. It has to do with how we have learned to read women based on advertising, based on film, and also based on women.